Welcome back. It's time for another story. This one has a little bit of uh, violence between children in it, so uh, if that's going to bother you, please just just move on. Uh, no need to uh, put your you know give yourself any more pain than needs to be. This life has plenty all by itself. All right. So I was uh, I was somewhere. I was six or seven years old. It's very difficult to remember. It was a very long time ago. But I was six or seven years old. Uh, my mother coached my two older sisters in kickball. We were at the kickball field at Mountainville Memorial. <clears throat> and uh, I, um, I wandered off from the field a little bit. Uh, I, was, uh, I was able to roam a little bit, mainly because my mother was a bit distracted with coaching the girls in kickball and um you know i could sneak away sometimes so i sneak away uh, i sneak across the bridge uh that's over this uh little creek there and um i see these uh i see there's one teenage boy he's standing up and he seems to be directing uh and then there's two teenage boys on the ground and um one of them looks an awful lot like my older brother. So I go walking over there, and sure enough, my older brother is on, on the bottom. Uh, these two guys are wrestling. I think they're probably fighting, but I'm not sure. Uh, and the, the kid that's standing up, he says, Hey, kid, come here. And, um, and so I'm like, yeah. And he says, You see that guy on the bottom? Kick him in the ribs. And, you know, I'm a little kid. But my entire life, I look an awful lot like my older brother, okay? Uh, now that we're both old, uh, the, the main difference is uh, he's a little more wrinkly. He weighs a little more. Um, he isn't bald like one of us. And he has blue eyes. I have green eyes. Um, but we still, if we have the same haircut, we, we, look, we look very similar, okay? You can tell we're brothers. So this guy isn't paying very much attention. Okay, and I think I'm going to take advantage of this. So I walk up and I kick, um, not very hard, but I kick the guy on top. I kick him in the ribs. And uh, the, the guy standing up goes, no, kid, what are you doing? <laughs> the guy on the bottom, kick him in the ribs. And so I do it again. I walk over and I kick the guy on top in the ribs. And, uh, <laughs> and he says, he says, no, kid, come here. And he points to my to my older brother, still not noticing. He looks me right in the eye and doesn't notice. Wow, this little kid looks a whole lot like the kid that's on the bottom that I want to get beat up. <laughs> so he says, this guy right here on the bottom, kick him right in the ribs, right here. And so I take a big step like a field goal kicker. And I kick the guy on top as hard as I can in the ribs. And he and my brother roll over and roll down the hill uh, towards the creek <laughs> and my brother ended up scraping uh, his side on on this uh, this metal sewer pipe uh, the cement sewer pipe what thing whatever but um, <laughs> you know and the and the, the kid standing up still doesn't get it he's like what are you doing <laughs> and I said he's my brother <laughs> And the kid's like, oh, and of course the fight was over. Um, we go back to the, we, we go back to the kickball game and I tell my older brother, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I, I'm sorry about kicking so hard and you guys fell and, and, and you scraped your side and he just looks at me and he says, you did good little brother. There you go. Another saner than I should be story. <laughs> Have a great night.